Let's look at an assignment where your teacher has assigned you a Google file. I'm going to tap to open the assignment Google Doc attachment. Your teacher may assign you a Google Doc, a Google Sheet, or a Google Slide assignment where they've already created the file for you and sent it to you. In this case, it is not in the attachments area. My work is in your work at the bottom of the screen. I'm going to tap on the arrow at the bottom to open, and there I will see my assignment. This assignment will have my name on it, and it will have the name of the assignment. In this case, my teacher assigned me a blank Word document for me to work on for my assignment. So to open this, I would tap on the file name. A preview of the file will open. I cannot edit this file. I do not want to press on the pencil at the top. I want to actually go into this Google Doc to edit it, so I need to open this file in Google Docs. So to do that, I'm going to tap on the share o button in the upper right hand corner. And now it will open automatically for me in Google Docs. Once it's opened in Google Docs, Google Sheets, or Google Slides, at the bottom of the screen, you're going to see a blue pencil button that will allow you to edit that assignment. So I'm going to tap on the edit button. I now have my tools across the top for my font and my text. At the very top of the screen, you have a plus button where you can insert a bunch of different options. I would type in my assignment. Once I'm done, I'm going to tap on the blue check mark in the upper left hand corner. While you're working in a Google Doc, a Google Sheet, or a Google Slides file, it saves automatically to Google. If you are offline, it will save to the iPad and update as soon as you resume your internet connection. So then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to Classroom. So in the upper left-hand corner, you should see the option to bring you back to Classroom. So I'm gonna tap on Classroom. It will bring me back to Google Classroom where it's previewing that file before I made changes. So it's previewing the original. So I'm going to tap on the X in the upper left hand corner. If you want to verify that your changes are there, you can tap on the file name again. And now you're going to see the version that you edited. Then tap on the X. When you're completely done with your work and ready to turn in, you'd then tap the turn in button.